Welcome to Netlink Daily. Today's show is going to get pretty deep. So let's start with a moment of self-reflection. Hmm. Never thought about it like that. AMD's upcoming Polaris GPUs are shaping up to be some pretty exciting new products. But before the flagship graphics cards debut, it looks like we'll be seeing the 400 series in laptops. Lenovo has announced its Flex 4 series of notebooks can be outfitted with a Radeon M5 430 or an R7M460. Whatever those mean. Obviously, those are lower end GPUs and are also most likely rebrands, so don't get too excited. But it's cool to see the 400 series starting to materialize. Although, the Fury X2 should probably launch first. Come on, AMD, launch the thing. Now, here's a super interesting project on Kickstarter the Ausic X 3D personalized headphones. Ausic is a company started by a bunch of audio industry professionals who wanted to make sort of the last technological leap in headphones. The headphones incorporate multiple drivers and head tracking for 3D positional audio, which will be great for gaming and VR. But they also have sensors that calibrate the headset based on the shape of your head and ears. What? A bunch of people who are kind of big deals are claiming the headset is itself a big deal, including the CEO of THX. You know, the... We guys, <laughs> or not. we've reached out for a sample. Here's hoping they deliver. And the Dream Box is a completely DIY PC case kit from Taiwanese company Aerocool. The kit allows you to build your own PC chassis from the provided parts in the way you want, but it does not come with panels or windows. So your custom case will have to pretty much just be your frame, unless you get panels yourself. Interesting, yes. Practical, uh, it's unique. You gotta give them that. Plus, you can make all matters of other types of doohickeys if a case isn't cool enough for you. <gasps> you unerased it. He unerased it. Wow. What kind of sorcery is this? Nice job. If you want to see your small talk submission in Netlink, send it to NCX Tech Tips on Twitter or Instagram. While the newly announced Samsung Galaxy S7 and LG G5 both have micro SD card slots, neither of them will support Android 6.0's adoptable storage feature, where you can choose to make an SD card into essentially eternal storage. Probably to avoid the support calls when people realize they lost a bunch of data from removing it. In We're All Going to Be Killed News, Boston Dynamics has released a video of a new, more capable Atlas robot being abused by engineers. Not realizing robots years from now will watch said video and turn on their creators in revenge. They've learned nothing from Will Smith, have they? Meanwhile, other more peaceful researchers in Washington have developed passive Wi-Fi, which uses 10,000 times less power than current standards, while maintaining an 11 megabit per second transfer speed. Looks like we can say goodbye to Bluetooth and its confusing name. MSI has announced new mini PCs with mini STX motherboards inside. So I guess the new tiny form factor is going to be a thing after all. Doesn't really make sense, but all right. And apparently the FBI wants Apple to help with more than just the San Bernardino killer's iPhone. One of Apple's lawyers said in a letter to a judge that the agency has requested the company's access information on 12 other iOS devices. Oh boy. So maybe Apple is onto something by not wanting to set a precedent. Leave a comment with your thoughts below. New sources for all of today's stories can be found in the forum post linked in the description. James, while well John had had had, had 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 had, had 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 a better effect on the teacher. <laughs> no idea. English lessons for you. <laughs> Laptops are nice for some things and tablets are nice for other things. But when laptops and tablets come together, that's when something truly magical happens. That's why NCIX is giving away a new Lenovo Mix 700 Ultrabook. It's a tablet and a laptop with a detachable folio keyboard and a fancy watch band hinge. Not to mention, it's got some pretty sick specs under the hood. I mean, it's worth over $1,400. So how do you win this? All you gotta do is like NCIX on Facebook. But you can get extra entries by liking us on Instagram, following us on Twitter, sharing the contest, or getting your friends to enter. So click up here or the link in the description for all the details. And to make your wildest dreams come true. Okay, maybe that 
it's not gonna happen, but this is pretty close. All right, that's it for Netling Daily, guys. Thanks for watching. Click here to watch more videos. Follow us on social media over here. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX. <sighs> wow, this has been a truly life-altering experience. For all of us involved, I'd say. Really put things into perspective. Now, if you excuse me, I'm gonna go watch that damn Daniel video about 50 more times. Damn, Daniel. Damn, Daniel. <laughs> Back at it again with the white fans.